Hello everyone, Dr. Chris Martinson here with a quick update. One of my more recent episodes was about the idea that it looked like China was preparing for war. Now, I just put that out about a week ago and I gave three signs that it looked like this was the case. First, they were stocking up on food. Second, they were stocking up on fuel. Third, there were kind of bellicose, warlike statements coming from President Xi. Well, just a couple days ago, I think this basically on the day of Christmas, maybe the day after, depending on your time zone, we saw a couple of dozen, I think it was 71 total, planes, drones, and ships from China cross over what's called the median line, which is that halfway point between Taiwan and China. It's just a line some U.S. general drew up the middle of the Taiwan Strait at one point back a long time ago. But so Chinese military assets, again, provocatively, they've done this hundreds of times up to this point, but never to this scale before, never with this level of bellicosity in their statements. So we're seeing this heating up. Look, if you want to know what's going on, you need to have these dots connected for you. This didn't just come out of the blue. I've been talking about things like this for a while. If you want to understand where we're going in the future, hey, you're going to love my channel. I connect dots and I put things in a larger context so you can understand them. If I have any gift at all, it's to get what's in here into your head so that you can receive it and make sense of it on your own. China isn't doing this all on its own. This isn't going to be another unjustified, unprovoked attack like is being said about other wars. When you follow the context, you can see there's a whole sweep of history involved. This next decade is going to be particularly perilous, and you deserve to know what's going on and why so that you can make the kinds of decisions, hey, you're going to need to make to keep yourself, your friends, your family, your colleagues, your neighbors safe. Resilience is the operative word right here, and you should really pay attention to what's going on all around the world because the chance of getting through the next decade without some sort of a really major conflict is pretty much zero at this point. That's what we're barreling towards. That's just what the data says right now. Wish it was otherwise. I got to be completely honest about that, obviously. Nobody wants the kind of turbulence that we think is coming to actually arrive. With that, I'm Chris Martinson. This is another short addition to the Peak Prosperity channel. Please come by, like this, subscribe to this, come by my Peak Prosperity channel on YouTube. You're going to love it. Or come by peakprosperity.com if you want to hear my complete and uncensored views, because guess what? I still can't say everything I actually think out in public. Maybe that day will return, but that day is not yet here.